there is a reason for a prayer. You can just pray. What is prayer? Prayer is to receive power from God. The reason why we are praying is to receive power from God. To turn possibility to possibility. Prayer. Adura. The reason why we are praying Adura. is to receive power from God. To turn impossibility to possibility. That is the reason why we are praying. Adura. What you can do doesn't need prayer. But what is beyond human capability needed prayer. So the reason why we pray, we pray to turn impossibility to possibility. Let me tell you, without prayer, you can't succeed in life. Jesus Christ, our Savior, the one we are serving, our Messiah, he has a lot of promises of God. God Sorry about Jesus. Not only Jesus. People, the angel testified about Jesus. About how mighty his glory is. How great he is. That is a king. Not only that. The stars testify about Jesus. Not only that, the wise men testify about the greatness of Jesus. The wise men came before Jesus as a little as he is. They bow before him and bless him. But notwithstanding, with all this Testifier. The Bible says from age 1 to 30, Jesus cannot perform anything. Satan was following Jesus here and there with all the promises. Hear me, brother. For you to know that it's compulsory for you to hear. Jesus can carry those promises. Yet, Satan didn't allow him to succeed. From age 1 to 30. Until the day he went to River Jordan to meet his prophet. When he met his prophet, the Bible said the heaven opened. After those things, the Bible said the Spirit led Jesus to wither to do what? To pray. That was the first time you will, you will notify where Jesus is praying. The Bible says the Spirit of the Lord led me to the wilderness and, and the Son of God pray for 40 days and 40 nights. After 40 days and 40 nights, you know what amazing me? After the 40 days, when Jesus Jesus come out. He met Satan behind him. Satan, what are you doing here? I've been with you for long. But because Jesus received power, the Bible says Jesus rebuked the Satan. In Matthew chapter 4, verse 11, the Bible says Satan departed from Jesus and the, and the angel of the Lord ministered with to him. Now, until Jesus prayed, before he can fulfill his purpose, before he can fulfill his assignment, we all know the purpose of Jesus on this earth. The Bible says, for this purpose, the Son of God manifested to destroy the work of the devil. Imagine this. This is the purpose why the Son of God manifested to this earth. Then from age 1 to 30, the Satan behind him. Until 
until he pray. When he pray, the first assignment he did, after the prayer, what is it? He rebooked Satan when he pray. Because he have a capacity, he have ability to fight him. And the Bible says, he rebooked Satan and Satan departs from him. If you want Satan to depart from you, Christian, if you want Satan to leave your church, Christian, if you want Satan to depart from your marriage, it's not a matter of I'm a Christian. It's a matter of prayer. To turn impossibility. To possibility. I am telling you. You want to make it in life. Without bow for the gifter. You need the power of prayer. You need the understanding of prayer. When Jesus prayed, he can now fulfill his assignment on this heart. The purpose of coming up to the heart after the prayer, all the he rebooked Satan. So that means what the Bible says that for this purpose, Son of God manifested to destroy the work of devil. After the prayer for 40 days, Jesus rebooked the Satan. If you are going to rebook the Satan, you need prayer. Understanding of prayer. Wherever you are watching, wherever you are hearing, understanding of prayer, wisdom of prayer, knowledge of prayer, revelation of prayer. I prophesy someone somewhere, someone somewhere, to whom it may concern, revelation of prayer, understanding of prayer, knowledge of prayer, wisdom of prayer. Wherever you are hearing me, distance is not a problem. I declare to you, receive your 